a welcome fit for royalty, the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge were officially received in Singapore. President Tony Tan Ken Yam did the honors at the presidential palace amid the fanfare of an official honor guard. Catherine and I greatly look forward to learning much more and seeing much more during our stay here. Against the backdrop of Singapore's gardens by the bay, residents and tourists express excitement over catching a glimpse of the royal couple. But yeah, it was a nice experience to see them up close and they were really, really nice. They were talking to all the kids in front of me. It's a great thing for uh, the royal family and a great thing for people around the world to see them as well. Prince William's late mother, Princess Diana, enchanted everyone the world over. So too does the white orchid that was named in her honor back in 1997. But she was killed in a car crash in Paris two weeks earlier. That's why William was presented with the flower that Princess Diana was to have unveiled for herself. The prince and his wife also rolled into Singapore's Rolls-Royce Aerospace Factory, where William expressed pride over the obvious success between the collaboration of Singapore and British companies. It is also striking evidence of the much broader partnership between Singapore and those 700 British companies who are doing business here to the benefit of both our nations. As part of the royal couple's Asia-Pacific tour, they will also travel to other Commonwealth countries, including Malaysia, the Solomon Islands, and Tuvalu. Sonia Artero, TVB News.